Apple says that it gave their new Midnight M3 MacBook Air a new anti-fingerprint coating that aims to reduce fingerprints compared to the previous Midnight M2 model. But is this really the case? Let's find out. We've tried applying as many fingerprints and smudges on both, and here you can see that the M3 does indeed have slightly less fingerprints than the M2 although the difference is quite minor. In some of our other tests, the differences were more noticeable, with the M3 having noticeably less fingerprints, while in others, the M2 was actually the one that was less fingerprinted. Now, I've been daily driving the M3 for almost a week now, and from my usage, the fingerprints do seem to appear less than on my old M2 model, but they are still quite visible. So if you are hoping for a magical coating that removes all fingerprints and smudges, that is just not a case here. 